Are you kidding me, Scar? See, this place is like a new lucky landing to me. It has good loot. Look at all this good loot. Shields, scars, legendary gold scars, I mean, plus some Gs. like a waste, you know, like, 
it's hard enough getting mats as it is. So, unless you have like a ton of mats, then sure. But yeah, see, I'll show you guys this spot. It's like a bunch of nice little houses. It's kind of like retail, kind of like uh, greasy. It's a little bit more like greasy maybe than retail. Think of like Greasy Grove and Salty Springs and like a small area. That's this place. But it's comfy like I'm starting to learn the loot spots where like the chests are. I'm gonna keep the tech. Blue tech is pretty good. I watched a Cypher PK video on why he always picks the blue tech now over the pump shotguns and it was a good video. I recommend you check it out. He, he's really smart and Basically, like, you can fire more with the tech and do more damage, and the pumps are very slow now. He, like, explained it in his video. Unless you get an epic or, like, you know, a special pump shotgun, then sure, but... I'm just gonna keep this tech for now. I've been using it a lot recently, I forgot how good it was. Oh, let's go. We're gonna be full shield. All we need to do now is try to find a uh, campfire. I think there's one somewhere around here I need to remember. There's also chests back here, by the way. Scar, are you kidding me, Scar? See, this place is like a new lucky landing to me. It has good loot. Look at all this good loot. Shields, scars, legendary gold scars, I mean. SMGs. We have to go. I can't even loot up the entire area, but it's basically full of great loot like that, so it's it's a good landing spot for me. Holly Hedges, I recommend you guys check it out if you haven't landed there yet. Let me know if it should become my new lucky landing. <laughs> there is also this really good spot near Frenzy Farm, near like an orchard with like a barn that I like. So Frenzy Farm and like over here, all the edges are probably like my new favorite spots. Yeah, we're gonna be fine. We already have three kills too, right at the start. Ooh, gotta be careful though, cause these are custom matchmaking lobbies and we're gonna run into more Dynamo tryhard skins for sure. Storm's closing in, but I think we'll be fine. Ooh, I'm lagging a bit. I don't know if you guys saw that. It was like glitch. I was lagging just a little. Full health. There we go. The storm seems really slow for some reason. We It allowed us to like heal up and everything. I don't want to get caught in the storm though, but I think we might now. <laughs> it's worth it. Basically, the health that we gain is going to be the health that we lose if we do get stuck in the storm, probably. There's some ammo, blue pistols. Oh, there's a guy over here in a boat. Wait. Let's try to follow where this guy's going. <laughs> he doesn't even notice us. Let's follow him. Where 
is he? Where he is? Oh, I hear him. Got him. You gotta be faster than that to take out an ASM artist. <laughs> no, but that guy got a good, good shot off on us. Blue SMG saved my life, though, as it usually does. Thank you, Blue SMG. If it wasn't for you, that guy would have killed us. And he's spectating. Everyone's spectating us this game. <laughs> on them like this guy's being toxic i'm reporting you to epic games <laughs> i bet someone probably did that but i don't think epic you know will actually pay attention to that because dancing is normal it's in the game now if you dance on ninja though maybe maybe you'll get banned if you dance on ninja <laughs> you know imagine if if we ever get in a game and i just by some crazy like random way i end up like eliminating ninja by accident because there's no way i'd beat him normally and then i do an emote on him he'd probably get so mad and be like stream sniper <laughs> and try to like ban me from fortnite <laughs> please don't ban me ninja i was watching your stream since since the early days not even fortnite days Now that Ninja's on Mixer, I don't really watch him much. I, I do watch his YouTube videos from time to time. I don't know, I just never went on Mixer much. Like, I don't even have an account on there. Do any of you use Mixer? This is a weird cabin. There's, like, chests up here. I've never been in here. Oh, no, wait, I think I have been in here. This seems familiar. Um... I'm just gonna use this and then we can take that big shield. I feel like shields are more important than meds at the end of the game, you know what I'm saying? Ten people left. We got four kills. How much you wanna bet that the last guys are all like super tryhardy? Let's see if anyone like walks in here. I bet the final circle's gonna be like probably on the side of one of those mountains. Nine people left, so basically eight people besides us. Let's go. We should probably go high ground. Ooh, that looks like a nice spot. I haven't gone down there yet. <laughs> Each time I go through the map, I, like, find new locations. <laughs> oh, someone definitely came up here, though. This chest is open. I wonder if someone went in that house. Oh, there's a guy over there. That's who probably got the chest. Mm, I don't want that fight. Guys jumping on top of hills. Usually dangerous, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> now I just want to go for the win. We already have four kills. We don't need more. <laughs> Unless you're Urku. If, if we were Urku right now, I'd probably feel bad that we, we don't have like 15 kills or something. funny when you play with players that are good they actually like get kind of like saddened at the end of the game when they don't have like double digit kills they'll be like oh i only have nine kills feels bad and it's like what i'd be happy to have nine kills well i want this over here we can't let people know this house is been looted let's put that there someone will come in here get hit by the trap while we hide in the attic. Let's see if we can recreate the trap kill. I'm sure you guys all watch that video with the trap kill. People will walk in your house when you put traps in. It just always happens. At least one default will walk in. I highly recommend doing it. Especially now, because there's a lot of new players in the new season. There's so many chests in this house. this. Okay. No one will know we're here. We can just chill. Six people left. And I hear shooting like over here. So there's definitely going to be people on that side. 
seems like at least two snipers. This is good. We can chill here. Wait for the new circle. We can try to go for high ground like up there. And I'll just keep chewing some bubble gum. Uh, relaxing bubble gum. Still hoping someone walks in. <laughs> if someone walks in, I'm going to be so happy. I'm sure you all know the feeling. It isn't it doesn't it feel awesome when someone gets hit by your trap? It's just like, yes, you got hit by my trap. It it's it's it feels better than even getting a kill. The only thing that's better than getting a trap like kill is probably a shotgun, like headshot a headshot kill with a shotgun. Probably like the most dissatisfying thing in Fortnite besides a snipe, like a headshot snipe. That's really good. And then shotgun, like headshot, and then a trap kill. Those are probably like the most satisfying to me, at least. It's all about those headshots. <laughs> Cypher PK definitely knows what I'm talking about. He he does like the craziest, insane <laughs> trap kills ever. <laughs> I wish I could do those trap kills, but not even in my dreams. But at least I can watch his. There's still six other people. No one's eliminating each other. I hear a lot of shooting, but I don't see any eliminations. I'm pretty sure people built a base over here because I hear shooting there. Like on this side. We have a nice amount of mats, so I'm going to go like build a base. As soon as we have to move to the next circle, because we're still in the circle right now. Still holding out hope that someone gets killed by our trap. Ooh, someone just got eliminated into fall damage. <laughs> Feels bad. Two people left. It's a 1v2. 
One's up there on the mountain. I think the other one's over there to my right. Ah, I saw him jumping down earlier.
very, very soon. So, thanks again for watching. If you want to help support the channel, head on over to patreon.com slash ASMR gaming. And with as little as $1 a month, you can help support the channel and the creation of more videos just like this one. So, definitely do that if you can. And, uh, yeah, always enjoy reading your comments, so be sure to post them below. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you all next time. So long, and farewell.